Hello folks, welcome back to the channel. So you join me in the workshop and uh, I've just been browsing on the BSA website and come across something quite interesting. So let's roll the intro and then we'll get into it. So yeah, let's get into it. So. If you haven't seen my other video relating to the return of BSA from Motorcycle Live, check that video out now. There'll be a, a little card here, I think. Um, now, they have done a stellar job with that uh, and invested a hell of a lot of money in a combustion engine. But I've just been proud on their website, um, purely just seeing their latest content on, uh, on the new Gold Star. And um, yeah, let's take a look there now, just, just to... Give an indication. So over here, try the screen to record to start. Um, yeah, so over here, we've got the BSA homepage, and you can see there's a bit about their history, the new gold star, there's a register interest. Um, may or may not have already done that. And then there was this careers page, and I thought I'd just have a quick nosy, see uh, see what, what it takes to work at BSA. And uh, what vacancies they might have available and uh, I came across two specific vacancies here um, and as you can see they're looking for somebody with specific knowledge in electric vehicle development for various aspects of that particular profession um, it's the same across both of these jobs I believe yeah this was just about EV programs DC DC converters and the likes so it would seem without any real big announcement BSA are already looking to go down the electric vehicle electric motorcycle Avenue now obviously it's not a new thing um, zero have been kind of paving the way in electric motorcycles for a good number of years and are building some pretty nice pretty lightweight modern looking motorcycles um, and Harley have, have obviously dabbled there with the live wire and seem to have done pretty well. They're not the longevity is like that on that. We'll have to we'll have to have a look into that. Um, I know Triumph are working on a project at the moment. Um, all of which photos will be scattered around now. Um, and Royal Enfield announced last year, the year before, that they were going to look into or start producing electric motorcycle. So it's not a new thing. But I just find it intriguing that uh, BSA only being kind of relatively new back into the game are already uh, heading in that direction having spent what must have been quite a bit of money to develop a new internal combustion engine. Um, so yeah, it, it, it's an interesting move and it'll be interesting to see what avenue they go down in terms of an electric motorcycle because obviously the idea of electric running with electric is to make it as efficient as possible, make the bike as light as possible. And the modern classic, classic styling, that kind of thing, doesn't really lend itself to lightweight motorcycle production. Um, so therefore the things don't kind of go hand in hand. And they are very heavily lent on the history of BSA, even though it's not a true lineage in terms of they bought the brand and they're starting out again. But they are, you know, relying on that intellectual property and that that heritage to sell the brand and be their main marketing tool. So I'm not sure when they haven't fully established themselves in an industry yet how they're gonna play this one out. Be, you know, they haven't announced an electric bike. All they're doing is putting the foundations in with uh, getting the right people in to start developing that sort of thing. And you know, it's it's sensible to look into those sorts of things, but. Yeah, it'd be uh, be interesting to see what comes out of this. Um, I'm still waiting to hear on getting hold of the new Gold Star, the 650. Um, I think it'd be a very different experience, and I can't imagine they're going to just put an EV system into that particular bike. So is that a whole other motorcycle they're going to develop? Who knows? Um, it's only a relatively short video. I just wanted to cover that just as I saw it. I, Done a bit of searching, didn't see that anybody else had uh, grasped hold of this yet. 
and uh, thought I'd start the conversation. So let me know in the comments below, guys, what, what you think about them making this move or looking to make this move this soon into their their production. Um, yeah, I'm not so sure. I don't know. But, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Click like, subscribe, all the good stuff, as per usual. Um, plenty more content to come, as always. Uh, yeah, and if you like this sort of thing, then maybe we can have a look into some other subjects relating to new things, new developments in the motorcycle industry. But, yeah, just thought I'd try this one out. Take it easy.